Hi, this is Sean from Martell's Coins, and today we recently got back our cash submission. Let's see what we have. We recently just got a cash shipment back of some high-end coins, and I'm very excited to share it with you guys. So let's switch up to the close-up camera and open this bad boy up. So we finally got our cash shipment back. Some nice, exciting coins, some high-end pieces. I'm very excited about it. It's probably one of the best openings we're going to have on YouTube so far. So let's open this up. All together, we got 12 coins. Let's start with the first one. First coin up. Take it out of the little baggie. Got an 1880S Morgan Dollar. And as you may notice, it's got nice flashy fields. And this one did not cack. Even though it's a very pretty eye appealing coin, they did not cack it. But it is still a PC Jess MS65 Dimple, which is a very nice coin. Next coin up. is my favorite type of holders we got a pcgs old school rattler nice little 1880s once again and this one was originally a 64 and they did cack it to me it looks like a 65 coin for modern grading but very nice little cack sticker on this one Next up, we have a little Morgan for variety. This is an 1878 first year Morgan dollar. Seven tail feather. And what you notice on this one, it's got the wide angle feather to the arrow, which means this is a reverse of 1879. And unfortunately, they did not cack this one. But it is an MS-64. Very nice coin. Next up. As a coin I thought they were really going to cack. It looks really nice. Very nice eye appeal. 1861. Seed a quarter. Very nice coin. Nice eye appeal to it. So I... I was sure they're going to cack this one, but they didn't. But it's still an MS-63 seated quarter. Very nice. Seated stuff is one of my favorite type of type U.S. type coins. Next up. Switching over. I'll put this one next. Switching over to Nichols. Oh, we have another one that didn't cack, but it's very pretty coin. It's an MS66 1941 Walking Liberty half with amazing toning details to it. Nice original toning. This coin I bought raw originally, and it came in an old little tin album. And the little tin album sometimes will tone coins. So it's still a nice, great eye appeal. MS66 Walking Liberty half. Next up, we have a 36 proof series that we originally bought out of a capital plastic holder, sent it to PCGS, and then now just came back from CAC. This is a 36 proof Buffalo nickel with a satin finish. Very beautiful coin. And this one did CAC, and it's a proof 67. Very nice coin. And all these coins will be available on our retail store. So please check them out. Or our online shop also. Next up from the 36 Proof Series. We got a 36 Proof Mercury Silver Dime. And this one did CAC. It's a Proof 66 with CAC approval. 
Very nice. Next up, we have the penny of the series. This is again a satin finish proof. Lincoln scent. Nice little wood grain toning on it. And this one also did CAC. And it's a proof 65 red brown. Last item. Hold. Second to last item. This is the proof Washington quarter, 36 proof. Nice little eye appeal of a coin. A little bit of haze, but that's normal for the early proof sets. And this one also did CAC. And it's a proof 64. Very happy the CAC set in the 1936 proof sets really shaping out. Next up, 1936 proof, Walking Liberty half. And like I said, all these coins came out of one capital plastic holder. And this one also did CAC, and it's a proof 63. Nice coin. Next two I'm really excited to share. There's some rare coins, so these next two, something you never hardly see. At least one of them in this type of condition. The next one after this is you never see. Okay, next up, we got a 1937 Buffalo Nickel. And what's special about this? It's a three-legged Buffalo. Very nice. And this one originally came back, MS-62, and it also cacked. Very nice. Great investment piece with nice condition and nice original luster on it. Very happy about this one. And last one, I bought this from another dealer recently. I've never owned one. And when I saw it, I'm like, this is too nice for this type of grade. I almost cracked it out, but I was like, you know what? I'll leave in its older holder and just send it off to CAC. And here you go. It's a 1916 Standing Liberty Quarter. I mean, look at this thing. It's got a little, little bit of wear to it, but nice original luster to it. You really don't see them this nice. Usually 16 quarters, you see them in VG goods very few of them you see in this type of condition and this one a 53 and it cacked also very awesome very excited about this coin well thank you for joining me on this video Always like and subscribe to our videos and we'll have some more future coin videos. I know we got a bunch of stuff with the grading companies right now, so hopefully it comes back. And you can always check this these coins out on our website at hotelscoins.com. Thank you and I hope to see you again next time.